Yet despite the difficulties in accounting for clouds and oceans, scientists are confident enough in their climate models to begin to make predictions. One Princeton scientist, Dr. Siokuro Manabe, speculates that warming will not be evenly spread around the world. Instead, the greatest warming, up to 18 degrees, is likely to occur in the polar north. And paradoxically, the biggest effect would be in the winter. When you think about in winter in this region, air temperature may be minus 30 degree centigrade. It's very, very cold. But underneath the sea ice, there is a minus 2 degree centigrade water there, so that there is a large heat conduction through sea ice into the air from the underlying seawater. Now when you think about this warm climate, then sea ice is thinner, therefore more heat conduction coming from underlying water into the very cold atmosphere, so that warming is particularly large in winter.